Hello, my name is Robin Huris, and I have a very rare genetic condition called dyskeratosis congenita. I'm also the president of Dyskeratosis Congenita Outreach, a nonprofit foundation supporting the needs of families affected by DC. If you're watching this video, you're one step closer to helping DC Outreach achieve its goal of printing the first ever clinical treatment guidelines. This is a book that will help doctors around the world understand this mystifying disease. If you're watching this video, you're one step closer to ensuring that not one more child is lost due to lack of information and inappropriate care. DC is a very rare condition that occurs in less than one in one million people worldwide. It affects systems in the body that have rapid rates of cell reproduction, so areas like the bone marrow and skin and places with linings such as the mouth and esophagus are prone to malfunction. People with DC are likely to develop bone marrow failure, pulmonary fibrosis, lymphomas, cancers of the head and neck, and a host of other symptoms. I myself underwent a stem cell transplant nine years ago and this December will be happily celebrating my rebirthday. And while I might not look very sick today, it is largely in part to very well-versed doctors who took care of me that allowed me the gift of continuing to live healthily today. Unfortunately, this is not the case for most doctors. Lack of information prevails, and due to this misunderstanding, more often than not, patients receive inappropriate care. In my own life, for instance, my father suffered from anemia and had his doctors access to better information. He might have received more appropriate treatment and be alive today. Unfortunately, he died at the age of 43 due to DC-related complications. But my loss really is nothing compared to so many others. Parents come to DC Outreach heartbroken because they lost their child, because their doctors didn't know how to identify DC and didn't know how to treat it appropriately, which is why DC has set about printing the treatment guidelines. It will be authored by more than 24 experts from around the world and address every symptom area in the body. We can't print this book without your help. We are run by volunteers and depend exclusively on donations to meet the needs of our members. But because so few people have DC, uh, roughly uh, several thousand people around the world are estimated to be affected. The funding base for contributions is very small. We need your help today to make a difference in the lives of people affected by DC. We need your help to educate doctors. You can make a difference. Thank you.